Hey guys, good morning. Vlogmas day eight. Oh my gosh. Okay, quick catch up. What I've been up to. I have been wanting since like two years ago to. Hi, vlog. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. Good morning to you. I have been wanting how everyone like watches Christmas movies during the holiday season. My whole thing is you guys know I'm off and I have been wanting to watch Christmas horror movies. So we finally started doing that the other night and it's been so much fun I can't even tell you. I will be sharing with you guys some of the movies that we've been watching but excuse me sir but here are a few photos of the ones that we've seen so far. Hi, you guys. Other than that, I started on a Christmas gift. Excuse me, say. Excuse me, say. The yarn that I picked up say. during the beginning of Vlogmas. You guys can see here, I have started, hey, excuse me, a little project. I just started this last night, maybe for like an hour or so. A cozy holiday color along. It's being hosted by Reading with Pugs and Sammy over at Color and Chat with Sammy, I believe. I'll link their channels below. So basically, make your snacks and beverages, grab your holiday coloring books or any works in progress that you're working on, set up your stuff, and basically we're all just gonna color together and like chat. And it'll be the first one I'm participating in and I am super excited. I'm hoping to read a little Krampus before it actually starts. I'm really not making the progress that I want to make and every time I pick it up like I really like how it's written so. Also on the agenda for today, I need to fill out my Christmas cards so I can mail them probably Monday. Ah, I have been working in this Christmas coloring book. Shouts out to Musical Tati that put me up on game back in October. And I ordered this when it was released. Beauty of Horror, Ghost of Christmas. I wasn't even up on game with the whole Beauty of Horror coloring book series, but you guys know I am a horror fan and anything creepy Christmas is right up my alley. So the picture that I've been working on is actually the one from the cover. This is what I have so far. Not sure if this is the piece that I'll be working on during the color along. But let me show you guys what I got earlier in the week that goes right along with what we're talking about. Since I've kind of made a return to coloring, I have been seeing people haul and share like their supplies that they work with and if you're into art and design, illustration, anything like that, you know what Copic markers are and how they're like the top of the line for alcohol-based markers, but they're super expensive, like you get what you pay for. And so I've been watching a lot of videos for cheap alternatives for Copics and I ordered the Ohuhu, I don't even know what pack, 40 pack, tool tip markers. Let's see here. These are alcohol-based markers. Very excited to try these out. I can't believe I haven't opened this before now. Here's one side. But it doesn't have a brush pen. It's got more of a nib on this side. And the only thing I know I'm probably not going to care for is the fact that I can't stick the cap on the tops. And they're numbered instead of color. A while ago, I also ordered the Crayola colored pencils a 50 pack. I was looking into getting colored pencils, but they're so expensive, the more top of the line ones, and I wasn't sure for how long I was gonna be interested in coloring again since I kind of fell off. So I was like, what's a good cheap alternative? And everyone seems to say the price for like the quality that Crayola for like your basic leisure color colorist is the best option for cheapies. But just from coloring what I've colored in the Beauty of Horror Christmas book, I can already tell I want something. I got the Stadler pencil sharpener. I also got a Gothic Christmas by Deborah Muller. These pages are super thin though. 
if I color with marker. But I have a solution for that as well. I actually had it with me in Palm Springs, if you guys noticed it in the background when I was talking about my coloring. Hang on one second. I've seen people use like a hard plastic sheet to put in between the sheets of their coloring. Um, I was looking online, I couldn't find it. But sheet protectors. I'm just gonna put one of these in between the pages to prevent bleed through. It's not as heavy as what I've seen, so I don't know if this is gonna be a problem slipping and sliding, moving around, but better than nothing. And I'll keep the pages that I'm not working on from getting ruined. So hopefully this works. That is it for now, guys. I am going to try to pick out a page from this. If I don't find something that's truly calling to me, then I will work on finishing the one that I started in Beauty of Horror. So I'm gonna read this for a little bit and then I will get my little area together, make me tea, and get ready for the holiday cozy coloring along. Ready to go, I've got breakfast, gingerbread tea, work in progress, but I'm probably gonna work on my supplies and the live stream. <laughs> cozy coloring night with color and chat with Sammy and this is what I have managed to do so far in that time it was a lot of fun it wasn't a color along it was more of just like a color and chat uh, where we were all discussing questions and answers and just chatting away and coloring. It was a lot of fun. Um, and I got more accomplished than I thought I would. First time zipping up the case. Check it out. Like, come on guys, really? Totally happy with the markers, but give me a break. Doing it. That's perfect. <laughs> Festival of Light Hike. Hoping that we survive to tell the tale. Just checking in. What day is it? Vlogmas Day 8. So we're hiking. Still alive. Sunset is gorgeous. Courtney's back there petting a good boy. <laughs> but we're still alive, guys. Still kicking. For now. <laughs>